video is probably more for writers. This is Warracle. It is a card deck for people who have writer's block. Uh, there is no instinct like that of the heart, Lord Byron. So welcome to Warracle, a set of cards infused with magical abilities to call forth the muses. I mean, can it? <laughs> All right. MC stands for main character. SC stands for supporting character. And I think that's it. Directions. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath. After your third breath, think about your story. Don't think about the problems in your story, what isn't working, why you sat down to write it in the first place. After you have your story clearly in your mind, shuffle the cards. Your method of picking a card is up to you. You can fan them before you or take the first card at the top of the back. However you do it, just do it. Go ahead, pick a card and see what it says. The That card is the move in your story. Give yourself at least 24 hours to ruminate on your card and how it will play on the pages to come. 24 hours? Are you crazy? I need to get stuff written now. Okay. <laughs> Don't look at your card and dismiss it. But what if it's a dumb idea? After all, this card found you. Okay, I don't believe in that stuff, but all right, one last piece of advice. While it's ultimately your card, don't keep picking cards until you find one you like better. Um, I mean, isn't that how life works? It's how dating works. Alternate use of the cards. Don't have a story, but needs uh, need help getting started one. Pick three cards and see how you can combine them into a first chapter. All right, final word. Don't be afraid to, afraid to experiment. All right. So these, this card deck was $24, I believe. And it's made by this company who makes basically kids toys. Um, actually, this is $24.99, except for they make this really creepy looking um, like skulls and crossbone tarot deck. It's even called the Naked Heart. It's like pretty skeevy looking. Uh, so I don't know what their branding is or what they're about. But okay, so all the cards, like most card decks, are all the same on this side. And then on the other side, we get, and I'm not going to shuffle them because... Uh, when they're kind of big and I have small hands. So let's see. You were using me. The main character discovers that he or she has been unwittingly used by another. Is it for some kind of social status, such as money or a job? Or is it emotional, such as being used to elicit another's jealousy or rebound relationship? How does the main character come to this realization? What does he or she do? How does this affect the plot line moving forward? All right, there's something you need to know. Some crucial information, I'll just read like a few. <laughs> Some crucial information has been held back. Okay, this sounds exactly the same. Um, we have an eyewitness, six months at the most. Terminal diagnosis, oh my gosh. You're invited um, to a social event. I have to have it. The main character has his or her sights on a big purchase. Long time no see. The main character reunites with some long lost connection. My cousin's niece's half uncle's side. The main character discovers that she has a long lost relative. Uh, we've crossed over our wires somewhere. A misunderstanding. I did not mean to do that. The main character has unintentionally embarrassed himself or herself publicly. Honey, have you seen my? The main character discovers an equally important item is missing. That should be me. The main character is jealous of a supporting character. Uh, what's the matter with me? I I actually really like these. These are pretty good I, <laughs> good cards. Um, I will keep going. Um, I'm turning over a new leaf. What? No resend. Resend. Um, I've got to run. What was that? Who are you? How many cards are in here? I don't even know how many cards are in here. Does it tell you? Maybe it told me when I purchased this how many cards were in here. 65 cards are in here. All right. We'll go through all of them. How dare you? Call the police um, quick before they catch us. <laughs> Your main characters are criminal. Um, miracles. I'm getting the heck out of Dodge. Uh, is there something on my face? Put me in coach. Put up your dukes. Oh, put me in coach, like coach the person. They try a new sport. I was like, coach, like you don't want first class? Um, put up your dukes. Uh, sign up here. They do a hobby. That'll leave a mark. They get an injury. Wake up. They have a nightmare or a vision. Cue the pomp and circumstance. Graduates. Okay. Vacay all day. Leaves on vacation. On your feet. They join the military. Taxi. Uh, they're unable to take their transportation. Error. Uh, the main character uses regular stops. Wor working. Oh, avalanche. 
The main character's setting is struck by a natural disaster, the stork arrived, birth or adoption, happy birthday. Oh, that's a good one. I want a divorce, dearly beloved. Um... I do, a wedding, a funeral. I don't know why Dearly Beloved, um, I feel like that was like a wedding. I don't know why that was a funeral. Okay, will you marry me? They become engaged. Uh, ooh, they expect they get a windfall. Uh, you have the right to remain silent. Um, they get arrested, gather around, a religious or spiritual ideology. Uh, oh, somebody dies. I'm pregnant. Uh, I hate to tell you, but they receive bad news. You're not going to believe it. They get good news. Uh, they get a new job. They get fired. Uh, there's been an accident. They need to report somebody missing. Um, uh, someone's cheating. I really hate that card. <laughs> so lame. Um, collect a debt. It's not you. It's me. A sudden breakup. How could you do this to me? She's betrayed. Did you hear? Uh, they start a rumor. Lockdown. They're not able to leave their location. Well, we've all, no one wants to read about that, right? Okay, uh, guys, look at this. They look, stumble across an object. Hey, good looking, new love. I'm not so feeling so well. They get sick. Uh, an unexpected guest shows up. Um, they meet somebody new and they get a secretive message from an anonymous spender. I actually am very impressed with this card deck. I honestly, when I ordered it, I was like, oh, these are probably gonna be all cheesy and useless, but I think these could actually help. I will definitely not use it how it says. I don't believe in the universe, like <laughs> giving me ideas for my story. I think I'll just go through it and see like what helps the best and maybe make a spreadsheet because going through these cards would seem tedious. All right, let me know what you thought. Uh, obviously, this video is just for writers, but hopefully you found it fun.